Hello, my name is Rebecca Allen, and thank you for joining me today. To begin, I would like to address a word that is often favored by many industries that feel the creative works. Passion. Defined as a strong and barely controllable emotion. Every individual has this, but it differs for everyone. Let me show you what I mean. Each person acquires their passion from something they love, whether it's listening to music, designing a website, or just pursuing whatever their mind prompts them to do. For many, including people like you and me, it all starts with an idea. But before that idea can even spark, it takes something highly inspirational that can drive any individual to achievement. I found my spark at a young age, just when a creative mind can develop. Does anyone remember back in the good old days when school homework just included coloring, and you could spend your Saturday morning relishing your favorite cartoons? Perhaps we never really grow out of something that gave us so much joy throughout our childhoods. I can almost distinctly remember stepping into another world full of characters that I could relate to, and then that sparked me to draw, to pick up that pencil and sketch to my heart's desire. However, I didn't grow up as the most social butterfly in the swarm. I often kept quiet throughout my schooling because I couldn't stop thinking. I thought and thought about all my ideas and how I could expand them. I dove deeper into my cherished books so I could find the sparks to continue the drawings that began to develop into simple stories. But perhaps when you surround yourself with other people who share your passions, that is when you truly begin to flourish. Social networking had just begun to develop when I discovered an interesting community on YouTube, and there were thousands of them. They were like me, people who spoke better with pictures. I began to learn the complex world of animation along with them, and together we discovered tools that helped bring out our artistic abilities. We worked together to create MAPs, or multi-animator projects, where we all animated different parts of a particular song and put it all together. That pushed me to step outside the virtual world and find people in my own community who pursue different kinds of arts, such as performing, singing, and writing. I deeply value working with such passionate people, how their eyes light up when they talk about their inspirations, and their voice elevates as they describe to you how far their passion drives them. But then, their voice begins to falter. They lower their heads and their eyes dart to the ground, they apologize for being so excited. But why is that? Why do people feel so insecure about their passion? Did someone once tell them that their dream is empty? That they'll never accomplish anything with it? Or did their creativity burn away somehow? Did someone forcibly bash every inch of their motivation and drown it out? Some people find the future to be a terrifying thing, especially because it holds so much uncertainty. But the works that we pour every inch of our passions into influence other people to spark their own. I want to bring inspiration with my ideas and help forge a world where creativity is encouraged. I want to show our audiences that their passions are valued so that they too will go on to achieve their dreams. Now I present to you where my passion has brought me 